Anytime. Hi everyone, welcome to another episode of Coffee with Father James. I'm here at St. Peter's Church, uh, one of the churches of Our Lady of Guadalupe Parish. And today I'm actually drinking from my Divine Renovation travel mug. Why? Well, because it's one of the only travel mugs I have. I was in a meeting up in the hill and the great thing about this, you can get two coffees in this. It's really good. And there's some left, so that's what I'm drinking from. But there's another reason, which I'm gonna tell you about in a few minutes. First of all, I want to uh, let you know that on Saturday, January 20th, we will be having our next parish leadership summit. What is a leadership summit? It's when we gather leaders of ministry or ministries, the, very, the many ministries we have in our parishes, or those who are open to stepping into leadership, to come together, to grow together uh, in faith, to grow in community, and to grow in, in our understanding of the vision and mission of our parish and to learn uh, some leadership skills as well. So it, we've done, I think, three or four of them so far. They've been great experiences. So uh, those of you who are, are coming, you've already been invited and, and please mark that on, on your calendars. So, you know, it was once said that, that for a parish that wants to focus on renewal, to be, to be renewed, pastorally, spiritually, there are two things you have to over-invest in. One is leadership and the other is evangelization. And so you've probably by now realized that that's what we're trying to do. We're trying to really invest in, in being a church that evangelizes. Uh, we use Alpha and also focusing on leadership, growing our parishioners as leaders, as leaders to be people of influence. What we're going to be talking about on that Saturday is, is about the parish vision. What's our parish mission statement? Is to make joyful disciples of Christ who form a community that overflows in faith and charity. You know, joyful disciples, people who, have, who are followers of Jesus that, and, and who come together in community and that there's a natural overflow in, in works of faith as we share faith with others, as we evangelize and also in works of charity as we serve the poor uh, in our community. So that's our parish pur purpose statement. And what we're gonna be asking uh, parish ministry leaders to do is to really reflect on what is the, your vision for your ministry? Number one, what's your vision for your ministry? Because a lot of people often haven't even thought about that. What's your dream for your ministry? If you're involved in something and you're passionate about it, what would you love to see happen? So really to help people begin to pray and think and reflect in that way. And then to say, how does that tie in to the parish vision statement and purpose statement? So there's a lot more that's gonna be happening. There'll also be updates about the pastoral priorities that have been identified by the pastoral council. There'll be updates about the building renewal process. There'll be time of prayer, time of fellowship. It's gonna be a lot of fun. It's gonna be great. So mark your calendars, all of you in leadership roles leadership positions uh, for Saturday morning uh, 9 to 12 on January 20th. Now, before I let you go, there's another re there is a reason why I continue to use the Divine Renovation coffee mug. There's going to be a priest who's going to be joining us for two weeks here at Our Lady Guadalupe Parish. He is from the Netherlands. His name is Father Guido Kessels, and he's been ordained for approximately 10 years. And it's an unusual request in that, you know, he He's only coming for a very short time, uh, but we discerned together with Divine Renovation Ministry that this would be a worthwhile investment on our part for him. And he's gonna be, provide a little bit of help to us. So he's gonna be arriving on Monday the 15th, I believe, and he'll be here for two weeks. So uh, when you see him next week, please let's give him a very warm Our Lady of Guadalupe welcome as he joins us uh, for a time of, of learning and growing. So that's why I had my Divine Renovation mug. Or that's why I didn't get a new mug. That's why I stayed with this one. Anyway, you don't need to know that. Uh, God bless you and thanks for your time. Bye now.